time for show and tell. It's time for show and tell. Everybody come along and show and tell. I'll show you something new. I'll tell you what to do. Then you'll have a chance to show and tell me too. All right, time once again for Show and Tell. This is a segment where you can come on and talk about a special item, something you have that you want to share. So get out your cell phone now, open the camera app, use the QR code on your screen to find out how you can join us live for a future segment of Show and Tell. All right, we have two guests this morning, and our first guest, come on over, is Carrie Burns. Carrie has a vanity plate she's going to show us. Have a seat. Carrie, how are you? Good, thanks. How are you? Where are you from? Chicago. From right here in the city. Okay, and your special item is a vanity license plate that mm. was yours. Okay, we, we see that. Okay, and tell me about it. Tell me a story. So back in 2011, the state of Illinois issued, they started the program where you can get Cubs plates. Mm -hmm. So I went online and I chose WGN9 because originally the Cubs only were aired on WGN9. On Channel 9, sure. Yeah, so I chose this. So were you surprised that nobody had uh, had that one already? I was surprised WGN didn't have it. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. So what happened? Did somebody sneak in and get it from you, and, and that's why you don't have it anymore? Or what, how did that work? No, I had the opportunity to get a two-digit plate, which is also very rare for the common person to get. Okay. Um, so I got rid of it. I just had this vision <laughs> of somebody that works here sneaking in when you were supposed to renew it. You went, no, but a lot of skilling. people. You snooze, you lose. <laughs> a lot of people told me I should have kept it and sold it to you guys. <laughs> yeah. yeah, exactly. Yeah. Get, get the domain. So where is this now? This is displayed proudly somewhere in your home as a, yeah, as a decoration? Okay. Yeah. Well, thanks for sharing it. Thank you. Very and nice thanks for having me. All right, a quick reminder, if you have something you want to share on Show and Tell, use that QR code on your screen. Find out how you can join us live on the WGN Morning News for a future episode of Show and Tell. So now, guest number two, Whitney DeFogio, and she has a unique purse that she's going to show us. Come on in, Whitney. Whitney DeFogio. Hello. Yeah, that sounds like a good name for a restaurant. <laughs> DeFogio. Yeah. Maybe. You've got reservations at DeFogio. <laughs> that's that's so nice. Kind of Hopefully it would be Italian. So first off, let's, uh, let's tell everybody what you do for a living, because that would explain what you have here. Yes, I'm a dental hygienist, so I have a tooth purse. I'm, <laughs> you know, it's really <laughs> random for most people. You know, it's so cool. Whenever I wear it, I like, there's always someone who like comes up to me and says, are you a hygienist? Are you a dentist? And I always make like an instant friend. You well, know? What's important <laughs> to note here is that you made this. Oh, yes. So, okay. So I always wanted a tooth purse and like I Googled it and it didn't exist. <laughs> like nowhere. I was looking everywhere. So I was like, I think I need to make one. So, so you I typed it. it in and it, and it said, no one has ever search no, tooth purse ever no, in the history of I just, Google? I was scrolling through and there was like no tooth purse. So I was like, I need to create this. It was funny, the person I was creating it with, I didn't make it myself. I was trying to like explain like like the anatomy of the tooth. Like I really wanted the furcation, like this was the furcation. I was using sure, all the this. Furcation, like, of course. <laughs> yeah. I was using all this dental terminology and they were like, what? Like, and I was like, okay, we had to like start from the basics. So yeah, I love it. I'm sure you probably all thought of this, but you could make a whole business out of that or <laughs> well, maybe something you could store like floss and toothpaste and all the yes. things you would there is a little pocket that's like perfect for flaws, which makes me laugh. But no, I actually have a YouTube channel all about teeth, and uh, they, when they saw that I made it, they were all like, I want one. Because uh, <laughs> everyone budding, is dental on the YouTube channel. A budding business. <laughs> yeah. Well, thanks so much for joining us Thank and for, for, sharing, for sharing that with us. That's Thank a, that's you. A, a Does her shoe thing. say, please floss? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Can we get it? Can we see those? I love Can we it. see the shoe? Yeah. Please, floss. Oh my God. Right? <laughs> I just went with the theme, you know. Yeah, where do you get where do you get a pair of I shoes made, that says please floss on? I them? made these too. Oh, okay. That's not like you just go into Target and yeah. pick. I mean, they're no. gonna go with the UGG boots or the please floss. <laughs> they should. People should please floss. Excellent. <laughs> Well, that will do it for today's show and tell. If you have something that you want to share, use that QR code on your screen. Find out how you can join us live on the WGN Morning News for a future episode. 